from the YouTube Dojo. This is week nine update with Ellie Muir, and now Ellie Kadi Muir. Ha! Welcome to week nine update. I am Ellie Kadi Muir. Before I get get the rest of the show underway, I just want want to let you know that tonight shout out spotlight winners are it. At six and Wolfie Games, both of them are huge, are huge gamers in their own rights. Both of them are really cool, and both of them are pretty good friends of mine. So please check them out, and you won't be disappointed. Now, Trevor Noah is still on the Daily Show. What? Are you kidding me? He's still not good at being a late night talk show host yet. I mean, can you even make fun of the news? I mean, <laughs> come on. Come on. Now, Trevor has huge shoes to fill. Last year, he replaced not only Jon Stewart, but also Craig Kilborn. And I'll tell you something right now. He still isn't too nervous. I'm thinking, wait a minute. If I had to replace those guys, I would have been nervous too. So why isn't Trevor so nervous? Oh, wait, I forgot. He had a similar show in South Africa. Oh, boy. Anyway, that guy will probably get better soon. Or maybe not. He's still on cable TV. <laughs> At least Craig Kilborn. Man, you get a late night talk show on a main your television network. I mean, come on! Cable TV! <laughs> to show how crazy Trevor Noah really is, here's a clip from The Daily Show with Trevor Noah. Welcome to The Daily Show. I am Trevor Noah. John Stewart could not be here because, well, he's retired. <laughs> oh, chatter, chatter, chatter. Pitter, patter, pitter, patter. Something about the news that nobody cares about. And now here's my guest. The other hand. Hey, Trevor. Hey, other hand, how are you tonight, huh? I'm doing really well. How about yourself? Yeah, I'm doing all right. Thank you very much. Oh, okay. Pitta patta, pitta patta. Pitta patta, pitta patta. Okay. Here it is. The moment of Zen. <laughs> yep. There you go. There you go, folks. What can I tell you about the Daily Show with Trevor Noah? What can I tell you? Well, I can tell you a few things about the Daily Show with Trevor Noah. It's not as good as the Daily Show with Craig Kilborn was, and it's certainly not as good as the Daily Show with Jon Stewart was. I'll tell you that much. But I will give Trevor Noah this. Trevor Noah does have a brave personality. He's bold, he's pretty interesting, and he's somewhat likable. Now, all we got to do is to get him to tell funnier jokes and actually listen more during the interviews. Which, according to this fake Charlie over here, 
The chances of that, those two things happening are 559 billion to one. Yes, indeed. Let me ask you one question, folks. Do you personally believe that Trevor Noah could actually get another late night talk show in another year and a half from now? I mean, let's think about it for a moment. All right? Craig Kilborn lasted on the Daily Show for about three years and then moved to CBS to replace Tom Snyder as host of the Late Late Show on CBS. John Stewart stayed with the Daily Show for almost 17 years and then he retired. So, I guess the lesson here is if you really want to get a late night talk show, then don't start on the Daily Show. <laughs> when I say, oh, I'm you know, when I say if you really want a late night talk show, I meant if you really want to host a late night talk show on an actual network. You know, not basic cable. Alright, so. Or even premium cable for that matter. You know? You start on the daily show, then guess what? You're either going to end on the daily show, or you're going to get a show on a network that's even worse than Comedy Central. You know? Well, that is the show for tonight, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you folks tomorrow night. That's news, and I am out skis. Farewell, everybody. Farewell.